What's up, Bridgie Babes? It's your girl Brie, aka Robert Amir, and I am back with another freaking video. Don't know who I am. Hi, I am Robert Amir. If you do know, then welcome back. If you don't know, I'm a 21 year old stay at home mom slash content creator. Ow! You know you went in the million. I say, Robriella Amir. Robriella Amir. Robriella Amir. Slash nursing student. Ow! So basically, back with another freaking fall. Diaries. Are y'all excited? I'm excited. I love this series. I love, 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 love this series. Starting off this video, I have a mini haul for y'all. Try to get a good picture or whatever. Okay, so I have a mini haul for y'all. Starting off, we're going to start with what I got from Target last week. I told y'all last week that I went to Target and I'm, well, I placed a pickup order and I went to Target and I went to go pick it up and I've been so thirsty and I've been looking for it everywhere and God just really works miracles because y'all they did not have this they were not even selling this at Target they were only selling it at Walmart and the Walmart near me did not have it and grace to God they put it in Target and I caught it literally within the first two days that they put it in Target y'all and it smells so good i smelled all three of them when i first went to shop maybe i remember in my summer morning routine i went hygiene shopping and i seen them and i wanted to get them but i'm like no because i'm getting a bunch of other stuff and that's just a lot of body wash that i don't really need right now i'll just get them when i'm for fall to come about and when i went back to go get them they just didn't have them like they didn't have them nowhere i couldn't find them nowhere so i smelled this one i smelled the butter pecan one that one smells the best y'all and it was another one and i think they, they didn't have that and it was sold out y'all it smells so freaking good it smells just like pumpkin pie like cinnamon like spice like it's everything that it says it's so like i'm in love absolutely in love and i'm a a hygiene sink girly so i'm just really feeling that I actually want to go pick up some more hygiene products to go along with that in case, like, you know, for, like, lotion. Not necessarily deodorant, because I could just wear, like, my cocoa butter deodorant from Dove. I do want to get a lotion to scent layer with that, because I'm heavy on the scent layering. From Amazon, a new lens connector, because I need the sticky piece to connect my lens that I have, and it, kept, it keeps falling off. So I'm just gonna order a new one. I'm just gonna order another one. But I felt like it wasn't no need to order it right away. Way when my lens kept falling off because I was at the time contemplating if I liked my camera better without the lens or with the lens. I got to the point where I was just like, you know what, I'm just gonna get it because I feel like I need to have it just in case I do decide I wanna put it on there, which right now I do want my wide angle lens on. But when I didn't order it, I didn't have the option. I just had to have it off it onto my lens now this is the new adapter piece another sticky part that's what i like about this one it comes with another sticky part so that way when that sticky part starts messing up i don't have to order a whole nother piece i can just order i mean i could just replace the sticky part with this sticky part also ordered me a brown case for fall because y'all know i'm all things neutral color all things fall especially in the fall i'm a neutral color type of person because i just like browns like i always love every shade of brown baby this is gonna eat and i have my wide angle lens i'm really excited about that and, and this comes with a little a screen cleaner a lens cleaner whatever you want to use it for and also a screen protector because the screen protector i have on my camera now is cracked up i dropped my camera so much we're gonna start taking better care of my camera and that's why i was like yeah we're getting back into our mojo and all that so let me order all the stuff i need to go ahead and order for this camera and this is more so pertaining to fall which is why i opened it in this video and not the last video so i'm super excited about all of this stuff i'm about to go ahead and get my camera together i'm gonna come back to y'all next time y'all see me i'm probably gonna be handling my oral hygiene so we can go ahead and do what we're gonna do for today which i don't even know what that is but we're going with the flow and we're just we're walking by faith and God got us and he gonna push us in the right direction. I got out the 
shower i'm dressed i don't got my full outfit on but i just got like my top and my bottom i don't have my shoes on i don't have my brace and i don't have my sweater on i'm about to do something to my hair and i'm about to like do my eyebrows and maybe put on some lashes i don't know just so everything can look like somewhat decent probably gonna be in public today get this hair out i only had it in for like a week y'all and i feel like it's time to take it out already because it don't look as perfect as it did in the first like day or two. Y'all, I have no energy and I have no idea why. I just did my eyebrows and I cleaned them up with a Q-tip and no concealer. Like I'm so tired. I don't know why because I got a lot of sleep last night. I feel like the more sleep I get, the more sleepier I actually am. Which is weird to me because if it's like, if I'm getting more sleep than I normally get, why would I be so freaking tired? That's so weird. I have to curl my hair, probably put on some lashes because I feel like I look like a little kid without them. I don't know. I'm going to show y'all how I curl my hair. I'm going to put on my lashes and then I'm going to come back and show y'all how I curl my hair. Okay, y'all, so how I curl my hair is no matter what style I'm curling, I always put the piece that is out, like the end piece, toward the front. And that's how like my curls layer so well. I got a different type of curling wand because it's supposed to be a self curling wand, but I just don't like using it like that. So this is always toward the front. Y'all get what I'm trying to say? Comment down below if that makes sense. Because see why it wouldn't make sense, but I'm trying to explain to y'all the best way possible. I always keep this toward the front. Sometimes I'll be accidentally clicking that little self curling thing. But I really don't be meaning to go up as you go down. So the more you go down on the hair, like the more hair get wrapped up in here from the bottom, you still roll up. Like and I'm not pinning my curls today. If I was pinning them, I would drop it like this, put my finger in the middle, ball it up and pin it. But I'm not pinning it today because I really don't too much care about how my hair come out. I just don't want it to be looking too, too, too crazy. My edges look a little crazy. Take this out. I know, I know, I know. But right now, we're sticking with it. So, I'm going to just keep... It's standing, like, I got the curling wand straight up, but if I put it flat, it's toward the front. Y'all get it? It's flow. So, when I comb my hair backward and push it forward, it just, like, blows. Like, it's going to look really good. Every time I get a side part, my lashes be looking like I got a droopy eye. I'm still going to do this. Ooh. Still going to do this so that the curl can hold a little bit. I just don't care for it to like stick stick. Because I had some plans I wanted to do today. I wanted to go outside the house and do some stuff. But I don't even know if I'm going to be able to do this. This is supposed to be like more of so a day in my life type of fall vlog. But it might end up being way longer than that. Okay. So I just demonstrated it again, basically. Hopefully y'all can see it, y'all get the gist of it. And it should come out like real good. That T3 curl, T3 curl iron is the truth. If you don't got one, you need to get one. Because baby, these curls been eating, eating the girls up since I got these curl irons. So, yeah, I really don't know what we doing in this video. I always say that and the videos come out like so T. And I just love that. Like, God really be on my side. And I praise him for that so much because these videos could go a whole other way and they don't. So, I just got done curling my hair. It really didn't take me long at all because I didn't put that much effort into it today. Like I said, I want to go somewhere. I have some stuff I wanted to go do outside of the house, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I just literally comb backwards. Like, comb everything on top of each other backwards. Don't mind all this because... <laughs> And then I'm going to fix it some more. I'm about to show y'all. Comb all of it backward. See how they just fall into place? Like this one I got to fix. It's like a bang. So you comb that. Comb that some more. Okay, so all of this then fell into place. I just got to bring this down some more. Easy. Literally probably took me like 10, 15 maybe at the most minutes to curl my hair. I want to wear... I want to accessorize and get like a cute mirror picture or something. I don't know. I don't know. I want to, but then again, I don't. But it's just like, 
I don't know y'all, I don't know. Okay y'all, so I'm about to show y'all the pictures. I originally was gonna wear my fluffy Ugg slides with the like toes out. It didn't look right like at all. So I switched it to my Rick Owens and it looked a whole lot better. I'm probably gonna post these on my spam. I don't know, but I'm not definitely not posting them on my main. And I'm using it for a thumbnail, so if y'all watching this video, then y'all already seen the pictures. So we're gonna try this, the Chobani one. Let me get a picture. Okay, so it's pumpkin spice Greek yogurt, but it's the limited edition one. I bought this in like my first fall diary, so if y'all been watching my videos and y'all been keeping up, then y'all know. But I'm gonna try this now because I haven't tried any of the like pre-made drinks that I bought. I just been basically making my own coffees and stuff. So I really haven't drunk none of these in the morning. See, I'm kind of scared. No, like the other ones. It's not that bad. It's just really pumpkin-y. But I think I'm starting to like the pumpkin flavor the more I get older because two years ago, I couldn't, you couldn't pay me to eat or drink pumpkin flavor, nothing. But this is like, actually really really good and i also want to show, tell y'all about the shirt that i got on if y'all watch my regular my last regular vlog y'all see me buy this shirt from target and i really like it i feel like it's like very 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 close to skims it's super close and i'm super excited because now it's making me want to go get some more and i know i can like get skims quality without paying for skims because skims is just the rib sets is alright. Y'all know that's mainly what I got from Skims. But the other stuff, I got like two or three shirts from like just like the the smooth butter collection. And it's so good. Like it's such great quality. And I really, really like it. So yeah, that's that. I really don't know what all we're doing today. Like I told y'all, it was some stuff I wanted to do. But it's already 358. We don't have really nothing to do on our agenda today. And I'm just pretty much in the house chilling, boarding the house, and I'm in the house bored. I posted mainly all the content I gotta post. I gotta edit, but I don't plan on, I plan on taking like a little mini break from like posting and editing, not filming, but posting and editing. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just not, I'm gonna post on Thursday. It's Monday, September 23rd. I'm gonna post on Thursday. That way I can get back on track with posting on Thursdays and Sundays, cause that's my goal to post on them two days. So, Yeah, that's like four days apart. That's not bad. And then Sunday is Friday, Saturday. Yeah, so that's not bad. That's a good like little posting schedule. Those are the days I really do want to post. Um, I feel like my videos do the best when I post on them two days. So I want to get on track with posting on those two days. And yeah, that's just where we at with it. So I think I'm not going to post until Thursday, which also gives me a break. But it gives me a decent amount of time because I post shorts. So I'm never inconsistent on YouTube. I'm never inconsistent on on TikTok, on Instagram, like not posting for one to four days is really not inconsistent. I feel like once you go over a week without posting, that's when it becomes inconsistent. But not posting for like under a week is really not inconsistent. So I'm not really tripping off of it. I post as much as I possibly can. Sometimes I post three times a day, four times a day. Sometimes I post once, sometimes I don't post at all. It is what it is, but I'm not getting inconsistent and that's because God is pushing me through this. So I know I'm not getting inconsistent because God, because God. Okay y'all, so it is nighttime. I don't know what time it is, it's nighttime. And I'm currently doing my makeup. I don't know if I should, I'm coming out with what y'all think. Should I go like this, like put some lashes on, like do a little lash, cause my eyebrows and my under eyes is down. But I was gonna do like a full on beat. But I don't think I need that. It's giving real chill, cozy, and cute. So I'm about to just spray my face on my lashes. Yo, my makeup been eating down. I told y'all the fall is my season. It's my fucking season. Everything just been eating down. To do this, I don't think I'm going to do it. I'm doing the beginning of my eyebrows. I'm not gonna do it throughout the whole eyebrow how I normally do because it's gonna fade them out. And I like how dark the ends is right now. Yeah, that, that eats. That eats. That eats. I probably don't need to do much to my hair, but I'm probably still gonna do something because I don't want like you no know, no crazy looking curls. My freaking story views went up by like a thousand today. Everybody, everybody's waiting on me to say something, and I'm not gonna say shit. I'm not saying nothing. I don't care. I just don't care. I'm not. It's not even a joke. I seriously do not care. I cannot make me care. I don't care. I was gonna go do some 
stuff like some far more far related stuff tomorrow but i seen that bath and body works got their candles on sale for five dollars today so we're gonna go today because paying 16 dollars versus paying five dollars is fucking a steal i'm literally gonna go like i'm i'm it's a steal i have to go i was like okay i'm gonna just go get my content today or at least some of it because it is kind of late it's like eight something Giving real cozy chill fall vibes, y'all. It has been raining for two days straight. Like today and yesterday was raining crazy. Okay, so before we go, real quick, real quick fit, fit check. Louis Vuitton purse, Uck, New Mail, or however you say that, and Adidas set. I'm gonna see y'all once we're heading out because we're about to be ready to head out. Okay, y'all, so I know I was supposed to be going to the store. Y'all really, honestly, might not even see this part of the video. I might just clip it all out because I'm kind of a little bit irritated with it. So, it's currently 9.31 p.m. And I thought that I was, you know, yesterday when I looked at the time that the store closed, it said the store's closed at 10. So, I'm thinking, like, okay, you know, I got a little bit of time being at each store for, like, 20 minutes. If that, you know, go ahead on my day. I knew I probably should have just waited till tomorrow, being that it was so late. But I just really wanted to catch that $5 deal. I don't care how much money I got. $5 is a steal. If I'm paying $5 for something that I would have paid three or four times that, I'm going to get it. Thinking, like, you know, okay, I'm going to be able to go. I'm going to be able to, you know, catch the sale or whatever. Every day, they've they been having different sales every day. Tomorrow they might not have no sale. I don't know. I'm just leaving it in God's hand. I really just need to calm down because I'm aggravated so bad with this. The fact that I missed both stores. I can't go to no stores today. So I literally just got ready. Wasted my time. All of that for nothing. When I could have just been in bed. Editing. Doing something. I have a video to post tomorrow at 6 p.m. I still have not started to edit. And I'm only irritated because editing with that little two hours that I just spent getting me and Zana ready. Not even spent full, cause it was only like 40 minutes I was getting this ready and she was already ready. I got her ready earlier in the day, but I just know that's just my fault or whatever. I really was in bed for most of the day. I slept in till like one o'clock because it was raining. So I was just like super, super tired and like drained on energy. So I didn't get out of bed till like one o'clock, which all of that was my fault. Cause if I would've got up earlier, we wouldn't have to deal with this. I need to step back from everything for a second. And it's just, it's a lot of freaking family stuff going on. I'm trying not to cry because it's super personal and it's super close to my heart. This person is like, it's, it's my grandpa, like really, really close to my heart. I told you in my last video, just to send him prayers and stuff. Everything's gonna be good. Everything's gonna be fine. God has the last say so at the end of the day. So I really don't care with any doctor or nobody, none of that is saying, but it is just, it's a lot on me right now and I'm just trying to keep pushing forward and keep filming content and keep posting content. And I just have a lot going on right now. Like I'm in school, I'm a mom, I have to pass my state test. Um, I have still a lot of goals I want to accomplish before the end of this year. I have a lot going on right now, a lot going through my head on a daily basis. And for me to have personal problems going on, no oh God wouldn't give me nothing I can't handle. But I feel like I've just been praying so hard and I've been working so hard and I just didn't expect this to come in the midst of me just like, you know, in the midst of doing so many good things. And it's just like, I don't know. I've been being so consistent. I'm not gonna stop. I'm just gonna keep trying and keep moving forward and keep going. Like I said, at the end of the day, God has the last say, so I have faith that God is going to come through for my grandfather, no matter what is going on. So I'm not really tripping. I'm saying grandfather, y'all probably think like it's like my old, old grandpa. No, my grandparents are like in their 40s or 50s, and they act really, really young. If y'all watch my videos, y'all probably see him a couple times. I go to the gym and train with him sometimes. I tell y'all that he's a personal trainer. I just had to get that off my chest real quick because I feel like I've been holding it in, and I just, I just haven't spoken, and I just been super irritable, and I. I hold it in because I don't want to take it out of my baby because she don't deserve that and she didn't cause any of it. And she didn't cause the stress, like the stress between school and getting videos up in time and doing this. And she didn't cause any of it. So I hold it in to prevent taking it out on her in the wrong times. But I just really need to get that out. So thank you, Bestie, for listening because I really need to let that go. Yeah, we're probably going to pick up where we left off tomorrow. So next time y'all see me, I'll probably be in the car on the way to the stores getting stuff done tomorrow all the stuff that i wanted to get done which i'm not tripping because now i could just get everything done that i wanted to get done in one day instead of breaking it up into two different days and having to go like 30 40 minutes away from me to go ahead and get everything done
Life on the line in the north and I'ma send a man by the hoe Respect that girl so much, don't want no motherfucking brain from him That's all I want, that's all I need him I woke up, I ain't see nobody You ain't stay where I did, tell me what I did Y'all, so why did my freaking wide-angle lens fell off in a car before I started recording that singing video? And I was wondering why my camera looked so close to my face. And I looked at my camera and I'm like, my wide-angle lens is gone. But that's because it was sitting in between my lap. And I was doing too much because I was in the middle of trying to post a video while we was on our way here. But we're here now. We're at Bath and Body Works. It feels so folly outside. I just love it here. See, I'm losing all my focus. If you choosing on my chosen, cruising in this cold bins. So I'm picking up your friends. Give me dirty looks, cause they know a lot. A hundred with you, yeah, they know I'm not. Give her 25, not a whole, whole lot. Okay, y'all, so now we are headed to TJ Maxx. I just left out of there. Um, I'm gonna give y'all a haul on everything when we get back to the house so I can show y'all everything that I got. But we left out of TJ Maxx. Uh, I mean, we left out of Bath and Body Works. We heading to TJ Maxx. When we first walked into Bath and Body Works. As soon as we got inside, Zana started tripping. So my boyfriend and Zana had to go back to the car because she is sleepy for one. She hasn't had a nap since way earlier. And for two, it's her feed time. So she's hungry. We're gonna get her some food on the way home. But right now, I'm about to head inside of TJ Maxx. Yo, I got messed up buggy. These cute baby Halloween costumes in here for my baby. And I kind of want to get one for her. They got the type of, like, the exact type of stuff that I came in here for. These are only $12.99. And I think I'm going to get these because I drink coffee a lot more than I used to. So I feel like these will come in handy. So I think I am going to get these. But I came in here for fall stuff, so I really need to get out the regular section. I was looking for like a fall cup, but I don't see any, so this is cute. This ain't really nice. That Christmas stuff out y'all, look. Oh, I cannot wait for Christmas. This is about to be so fun. Looking for more of like pillows and throws and stuff. Already decorated like with like the little pumpkins and stuff, so. I'm not even really too much looking for that. Furthermore, they don't even have the cute type of pumpkins, so. So I'm leaving out of the pillow in the throw blanket section, and they really don't have nothing cute that I'm looking for. Like, Okay, so I didn't came in here and I didn't found this set. I was looking for like some circle meal pe pe containers because I got a lot of like triangular ones, so that I found these. I kind of want to get these, but then I'm going to have to get two. Right, so they only $5. I think I came too late because they don't have nothing. Like, they don't have nothing at all. They got a bunch of, like, fall Hello Kitty stuff. Like, want that. That's not what I came in here for. Hello Kitty or, like, theme. Oh, these are cute. If it's not Hello Kitty and it's not theme, then it's pink. And pink is cute. I'm a pink girly, but when it's fall, it's fall. Okay, y'all. So I also found my skincare stuff that I need in here. This bottle is twenty dollars everywhere else. This is fourteen. So, okay, y'all. So I actually ended up finding some mugs that I was looking for. So I'm gonna put these back because I found these. I'm going. This is four ninety nine. Okay, we're gonna go with this one. Our mission to come in here and find the little pumpkin pillow was an absolute fail because they didn't have them. I think I came too late. Everybody was getting started on fall like last month and it's only September. Fall just started a couple of days ago, like four days ago. So, y'all look at all of the fall decorations. I just love it so much. A few things. I'm bringing y'all with me. So much fall in the air. I know I never tried apple cider. I was gonna try it when we went oh, this grocery cart so loud. But I was gonna try it when we went to Hatch, but somebody else wanted my apple cider, so I gave it to them. They don't never have my candy grapes. They're gonna have it at the end of the month, y'all. Uh, I have to get Azana some fruit. I forgot I even had to do that, so I'm glad I came in here. I have to get her some fruit because 
my baby loves bananas i love bananas and yes we're gonna get some fruit and then i'm gonna get her one of these but i don't know which one because she don't when i be trying to give her my watermelon she'll be wanting to eat it but she need to get her fruit in so we're gonna get one of this a watermelon and a strawberry oh wait y'all she can't have blueberries so i'm gonna get this can't have nothing touching blueberries because she'll throw up so we're gonna get the kiwi one okay so now i have to get milk mozzarella cheese and rice cups for Adana. okay so i'm just gonna get her two because i need to go grocery shopping and if i don't get all of them right now that'll remind me to go grocery shopping get one of these and i'm gonna just get another thing of cinnamon rolls but I want like the big one. I don't think they got no big one. There's eight in here. Oh, the big ones are right here. I'm gonna put these back. This is what we're gonna get. See, what did I just tell y'all? 20 freaking dollars and I just paid eight dollars. Let's show a little I respect, man. You, yeah. I'm about to eat this man food. Ma'am, bring it real, bro. Come on, y'all probably beat your ass tonight since my food. <laughs> I already told y'all in the last video how you post the season at Swinson's and all that. Why you keep trying to be the fucking judge, the judge of my food? Nigga, I'm eating these fries. What is wrong with you? I'm trying to hush fire, um, deploy that car seat out the roof. You ain't deploying shit at my child. Oh, wait, I lost that, that little lid. I ain't just losing my shit. You better hold your little folly ass camera before it falls. Give me like five okay so we are officially back at the house and i'm gonna give y'all a little mini haul of everything that we got that somebody works you got my bag ripped because i guess it got wet over here somehow but it ripped but we're starting off with bath and body works what i got from there was two candles and a room spray i didn't catch the five dollar candle sale but i did catch the ten dollar candle sale so if you bought two candles then they were ten dollars the single wick and i got the single wick ones because i have still have two candles for mother's day and i have the candle on my nightstand so i'm still up three candles Ooh, back and i really don't need no more candles right now but i did want to get some fall scented candles and i'm all for the neutral color so that's really why i wanted this specific one y'all it smells just like hot chocolate i kid y'all not i would not lie to y'all like it smells just like hot chocolate and then i got the I didn't even tell y'all the name of it. It's the hot ch hot cocoa and cream candle. Then I got the spiced apple toddy candle. So good. Around Christmas time, I'm probably gonna like re up on like a bunch of candles and stuff like that. But for right now, I have a bunch of candles still. I have three candles and I just added two more. So this should last me until like at least the end of October. I say November because it's about to be October. Also got the whipped honey and vanilla room spray. And this smells good. I smelled a bunch of them and I was like starting to like choke on this. I smelled so many of them. Like it was like getting into my lungs really bad. That's what we got from Bath and Body Works. We just picked up three little things. Now we're moving on to TJ Maxx. To be honest with y'all, I got one thing from here that was pertaining to fall because, like I told y'all, they had little to nothing. Everything that they had was so ugly. Yeah. It would smell like you spray something. It was this room spray. It smelled good, don't it? Hell yeah. I feel like I'm walking in the bathroom by the works myself this time of year. <sighs> Damn. Max had little to nothing, so I got the one thing that I genuinely liked and wanted and I wasn't just about to spend money on just anything because they had it because that's it's ugly. But the thing that I got that was related to fall was oh I got this Minkies in here. I had to I had to put everything in the bag to get out the car. But I got this little skeleton coffee mug and I've been drinking coffee a lot more lately so this is like I didn't have to do all that but I was gonna get four. Y'all see me in there contemplating, but I just didn't want to spend a bunch of money on dishes. And I have one, two, I have about four or five different sets of meal prepping containers. And I just really didn't want to spend a bunch of money on it today. And I wanted the smaller ones. These are kind of big, so I should be good with these, honestly, because these are really huge. And now that I'm looking at them outside of the store, I could tell how fucking big they are. 
are the meal prep containers. I got there for $5.99. So if you want them, go get them at TJ Maxx. I have skincare stuff because I showed y'all the price difference when I went to another store. This was $20. I kid y'all not. I'm about to show y'all. Where's the price tag? I paid $7.99 from TJ Maxx instead of $20. That's a steal, you can't beat that. And I really needed this. Like y'all, I was out for a little minute because I couldn't find it nowhere. This was $14 in another store, which I didn't show y'all, but it was $7.99 also in TJ Maxx. A steal, this is, TJ Maxx is originally where I started using these two products from because right before my 18th birthday, I was in there just looking for stuff to go on my Miami trip that I didn't end up going on because my friend group fell apart right before we went. It is what I was, I picked up this stuff and I was just picking up a bunch of stuff I thought would work and I was like oh I like this stuff and it was really working for me and I stuck with it. TJ Maxx didn't have this for a while so I started buying it from somewhere else and they was literally charging like $20 and I used to always get this big bottle and I started to get the little bottle because I was like hell no I'm not paying $20. Last thing we got was this set of cups which because I feel like it was a steal they cost so much on Amazon y'all and I'm gonna open them up four piece set two for $12 like you can't beat that Amazon is literally probably like how much do it cost on Amazon I don't know probably like 15 16 dollars plus shipping look at this y'all it's dirty right now I gotta clean it but same thing like this was this I just came up I just found some real good but let me be careful. I'm good at breaking cups, so I really do need to be careful. But I'm good at finding, like, some steals. TJ Maxx be having them deals. We also got a package, and my dad ordered this. I don't know if y'all remember. If y'all didn't watch my last video, go watch my last video. Because I told y'all that my dad ordered Azana the little tumbler cup, like tumbler Stanley cup that I was looking for, right? My dad ordered it for my baby because I went to Target. I went at the, a bad time and they didn't have it anymore. So my dad was like, oh, I'm at the check and see if they have it near me. And they had it and he ordered it and it came. He asked me that I get I'm surprised he didn't ask me by now, but his phone broke because he dropped it on water. And then I just been so freaking busy too. But I still make time to text him at least twice a day. I try my hardest to go. I love my dad. Oh, these are so cute. They're bigger than what I thought, but these are really cute. This is what they look like. Look at Zana. She's still like, trying to get up now. I should have left her alone. She's drinking her bottle. These are yours, but they're kind of big. You think they're big? Not too big. You get a Stanley cup. No, 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 don't put your mouth on that. I gotta wash it. This pink one. Drink that milk. Mm -hmm. And then this purple one with these design front. So that's pretty much my little haul for today. Um, I'm about to put all this stuff up and I really don't know what I'm about to do after that. I just know I'm about to put all this stuff up. Good morning, y'all. I made my very handy dandy coffee. I had it in a couple days, so I'm literally like steaming. I've been steaming. I had it in like a week because last time I had it was when we was at clinicals on Friday, and it's Friday again. So, yeah. I'm in my coffee. I really don't know what the plan is today. I know I have to edit content. I want to start editing this video and I also need to edit a lot of short form content for the video I just posted and I still had one video to edit from the previous fall diaries. So I'm living for it like y'all this coffee is so freaking good. Co coffee is way easier to make than I thought it would be. I was like, bro, I'm about to put all this coffee in here and put some creamer. Like, I never knew that you're supposed to put milk in coffee. And that's probably why when I was younger and I was going to the hotels with my family, we go on family vacations and stuff. 
I'd be in a hotel lobby making coffee and I just put the coffee in, put a bunch of sugar and creamer in this shit was disgusting. Yeah, I actually, I wanna get my nails done, but I don't wanna get in too crazy. I really just need a feel and I think I just wanna get all brown or new, I don't know. I just, I need something done because it's like this, I need a feel. I'm in desperate need of a feel. And she did so good, y'all. Her retention is so good. It's been probably like a little over two weeks, if I'm not mistaken. Probably just about two weeks, for real. None of my nails are lifting. And I would say I get my nails done, like, if I had, like, a schedule, it would be every two weeks. So that's perfect because they're not lifting or anything. And she did so good. Let me get my baby together. You want some water? I, feel, I clean her cup out and I fill it up with water. I'm gonna see how she do this so I can tell my dad. Here. Y'all, she just keep, I don't know what's up with her and water now. Like, she used to love water, and now she just lets it run down her mouth. And she'll drink water out of our Stanley cups. I think she know that it's her cup, so she just don't want to drink water out of it. Because she'll drink it out of the Stanley cup perfectly fine. Okay, y'all, so it is 4.57 in the morning. And I realized that I never, I wasn't feeling like myself. Like I was feeling like I was slacking. Like I just was missing a piece of me because I wasn't praying and reading my Bible like I was supposed to. And y'all can see it stressed me out. I grew this freaking pimple today, like literally today. So sick. But I also think that the gloomy weather has something to slightly contribute to it because it's not like how my fall day has been lately. Like, like super chill and like a little gloomy and a little bit of sun and no it was it's been full-blown gloomy i don't know why the hurricane is just passing through every state and just dumping this little water off and dumping all this sadness off and giving us all this energy but it is i also wanted to go get my nails done in this vlog but which is not going to happen because I have too much going on, too many videos to film. I have, I just have a lot, so much to do within this next like week or so that I mean, really like this next month, like the rest of this year is super, super busy for me. So I wasn't able to go get my nails done in this video, which I'm not tripping off of cause I'm gonna get them done eventually. I'm just not getting them done right now. And they're still done. I just need to feel, they're not horrible at all they're not even lifting but i would like a feel because i had them on for a little minute much was going on i did want to give you all that rundown before i end up the video on friday and i was talking to y'all but we ended up having a family night on friday which is why i didn't come back on because we you know we play games everybody ate um talked laughed i didn't come back on here because i was busy with a family night but anywho we're about to go ahead and go to my fall bucket list and check whatever we did off so i don't even know what we did in this video i've been doing so much fall stuff i can't keep track we bought fall candles we went fall decor shopping that's two things even though we really didn't find nothing fall decor because i already have fall decor and it's not too many places to put anything else and i really only wanted the pumpkin pillow which i'm gonna eventually get y'all gonna see that of course we got fall scented hygiene we got the Dove stuff, which is actually exactly what I was meaning when I said I wanted to get fall scented hygiene. That's what I had in mind. So there's three things. I did. We did. We started like the Disney marathon, but I don't want to mark that off until we do like a you no know, watch a little bit more. We was watching Ant Farm. Wasn't that Ant Farm we was watching? You was watching the Ant Farm Halloween episodes. I think that's all we did in this video. We didn't do too much. This was really like a really, really chill vlog, honestly, if you ask me. I'm just coming out here in this video because I got another video to start in the morning. It's literally 5.03 in the morning, y'all. I was up playing the game. I'm going to go ahead and go to sleep so I can at least be up by like 9, 10-ish. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you're not already subscribed, go ahead, hit, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because I promise you, if you don't love me now... You're going to love me later. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Tell a friend, tell a friend. I love you guys so much. Thank you guys so much for all the support that you guys show me. All the comments, all the love, everything. If you made it this far in this video, you already know. Go ahead and drop an orange jar. 
drop a bunch of orange heart orange hearts drop orange hearts y'all know it's fall drop orange hearts if y'all made it this far in this video i love you guys i'll see you guys in the next video bye breezy babes